Bye, Mom. I'll see you when the summer's over. Hi, I'm Mason, and this is Cinema Rewind. We take a look at movies five years back and beyond. Today, we're looking at the 1992 film, Three Ninjas. Who are you talking to? Uh, nobody. You're talking to somebody. No. Starring Victor Wong, Michael Trainer, Max Elliott Slade, and Chad Power, this movie is a prime example of 90s cheese. 90s cheese? That's dumb. Shh, I'm the only one who's allowed to insult my childhood. Just watch this. No phones! Approximately one hour, 24 minutes, and 48 seconds later. Wow, that was bad, but also kind of funny. Exactly. The plot. Three brothers spend their summer being trained in the art of ninjutsu by their eccentric grandfather. Aren't you too old to be in this camp? When they come home, their FBI father is stressed because he can't take down an evil crime ring. This crime ring is headed up by one of Grandpa's old ninja students. When this old student comes to Grandpa to get him to train his evil henchman, Grandpa won't do it. So, the old student sends three stooges to go after the brothers. The brothers do Home Alone-style gags to outwit the stooges. Then the old student says, Fine. I'll do it myself. Grandpa has to fight the old student to get the boys back. He does, and everything turns out just fine. The good stuff. For me, this movie is wildly nostalgic. It's cheesy and campy, but it's hard to look past that. I remember wanting to watch the VHS tape of this, and my mom being all like, ugh, I don't want to watch that. What's a that. VHS? I don't have time to explain. I like this movie because it makes kids feel powerful. You want to be a ninja? Get after it. You want to rig your house with Home Alone-style gags to outwit dumb kidnappers? Do it. The Pitfalls. Although this movie is nostalgic, I know it has its good and bad stuff. The whole movie, the grandpa has this wink at the camera acting that is just so bad. They wanted to make him the next Mr. Miyagi, and they failed hard. In fact, this whole movie feels like an amalgamation of Karate Kid, Home Alone, and Wayne's World. Okay, dudes. Operation Kick Butt is about to commence. Synchronize watches. What time is it? I don't know. Anybody got a watch? Awesome. I mean, even the cover has a quote from the Boston Globe that says, Crosses Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles and Home Alone. And that's a pretty crazy mix. In conclusion. It's a 90s movie that borrows heavily from great movies before it. It goes to show that lightning doesn't strike twice. I'm Mason. I like movies. We're here. Welcome to Kent. Wanna watch a movie? Woo!